Welcome to Voice Bootcamp, a global name in unified communication. Hello, my name is Faisal Khan, Cisco Voice Instructor at Voice Bootcamp. In this particular lab number 5 of FCCE 9.0 Resource Kit, I'm going to show you how to install CTI Server, CTI OS Server, and Agent Desktop Client. Uh, the task uh, are basically straightforward. Install the CTI Server first, followed by the CTI OS Server, Agent Desktop, and creating an agent. So, in order to install, uh, first thing I'm going to do is add under ECC tools. We're going to add a peripheral gateway setup, just like as if I'm adding a peripheral gateway. So I'm going to add new CTI server. So choose a CG uh, CG one. This is the client port four two zero two seven. Will be used by the CTI OS server to register to CTI server. Define your network interface cards, host names, and it's pretty straightforward from that point onward. So once the service is running, you can validate the process by logging into CLI. As you can see, the PG CGA1 CG1A service is running. We will go to C uh, ECC tool system CLI and type show process to val verify that the service is active. So CTI server 1A, you notice the status is active for Sprawler. Now under the CTI OS server folder, click on the setup tools. CTI OS server is required for the agent to communicate with ICM server. So yes, go ahead and select uh, stopping the SNMP service. Define the location of the maintenance release or the, or the patch. Here we're going to add the instance name manually, CUS01. For some reason it doesn't pick it up. If you're not sure, you can go to Domain Manager. 